bam. That's why you're here, to watch the video in detail. So with your back straight, sitting on the edge of your chair, carefully lift up your knee and bring it down. Lift one leg at a time. So this leg comes up, you hold it for five seconds and bring it down. Five seconds and bring it down. So you want to do this 10 times. After you've done one leg, go the other leg, five seconds, bring it down. Again, same amount of reps, 10 each leg. Then you want to lift up your leg and hold this. It's a little bit harder. Now, even though you're going to feel the thigh burn, you're actually strengthening your hips. Abs are being worked. This one, you want to hold it up three times for five seconds because then it gets a little tired. Again, both legs, the same amount. Now for the abs, if you bend the knee and you stretch it out, you're working the abs and also the hips. But if you make a circle with your knee bent first, 10 times, and you bring it out straight right into the same leg twice, you're gonna feel that work your lower abs too. Again, circle with the knee and circle out, leg straight. And this one's a little bit tougher, but I'm sure you could do it if you're ready for it. Grab the bottom of the chair. Just gonna lean back a little bit to support yourself and lift up your knees. If your knees are bent, you should feel it more in your abs rather than your legs. A better challenge is move towards the tip of the chair or the edge of the chair without falling down and bring it up again slowly. When you're at the edge, it allows you to lift up your knees higher. This one, 10 times. If you could do it 20 times, you're a super person. Because after a few times, you'll also feel your legs burn and you'll start to sweat really good. Ooh. So again, one leg at a time, 10 times, 10 times, leg straight, up and down, about five to 10 times, five to 10 times. Circles, circles, long circles, and knee ups. If you do those slowly, you're gonna feel a sweat. You're gonna feel your core engage, your quads, your thighs will get stronger, your hips are being worked. Of course, your glutes are being worked too. Sitting down is just a modified version of standing. When you stand, you have to lean on a chair, on a wall. Start sitting and start slower. The repetitions, the duration, and how often you do it in terms of how many times a week will affect the way you feel, tighter and toner. But remember, plenty of water, eating the proper food, processed foods, down or less or none, get good sleep. And that's how you get a stronger body, stronger mind. Stay tuned. We're getting closer to what you're asking for, that program. I'll keep you updated. Try these today.